What's up, y'all? There's some things I want to add on to regarding David Benavidez and Canelo Alvarez. I mean, this is just one of those things where it's so much to download, you know, with, with David Benavidez and Canelo Alvarez that you, sometimes you got to, you know, make additional videos on, on, on how that fight would go. Listen, man, like I said in my other video, Canelo Alvarez more than likely will win on the cards. But the problem is David Benavidez's jab is going to be a big problem for Canelo, man. That jab is a piston, man. I mean, um, he's one of the... Him and Errol. I love Errol's jab. I love... Who else's jab is... Joe Joyce. Man, but David Benavidez's jab, dude, is going to be a huge problem for Canelo Alvarez, man. And just like I stated, man, I said that David Benavidez is going to be right there for Canelo to hit. And Canelo... And Canelo is going to be right there for David B to, for David Benavidez to hit. So, like I said in my um, Who Wins video, it's going to come down to who can handle whose power. And, for, yo, David Benavidez, he throws with, with some serious conviction, bro. Serious conviction. This may be... I would have to... Man, listen, man, look. Look. I did say the only people I think that can give Canelo issues was Billy Joe, David Benavidez, Jamal Charlo, and Demetrius Andre. But I gotta say this, man, out of all of them, David Benavidez is the more is the most dangerous one out of all of them, man. He has everything that those guys have and more. He has the power. I think David Benavidez. I'm making a a, a who wins video between David Benavidez and Jamal Charlo as well. This dude is a maniac, bro. He's a maniac in that ring, bro. It, you can see it in his eyes. The dude is no joke. I know he had a few problems. I know he missed weight. I know he had a problem with coke. Bro, he's a problem. If you didn't see that in that ring last night, and, and even in his other fights, he the, the way he talks, he likes to fight. He likes to hurt people. It's like Deontay Wilder. You know, he likes to hurt motherfuckers, man. It's hard to beat people like that. When they want to hurt a motherfucker, it, they got that mentality. They're going to hurt you and destroy you. They are going to do it, man. Even if it take them, even if they got to take something to give it. That's a that's a dangerous person, man. So Canelo going to have his hand full if he ever fights him. No wonder he keeps saying he don't want to fight Mexican fighters because he know eventually, sooner or later, he's going to have to face David Benavidez. Could Canelo be a little nervous? I think so, man. I think he is. <laughs> but um, I had to just make this quick video about that, man. Um, this this dude is a is a serious problem at 168, man. And Canelo, man, this, I hope you can hear this. I know you're not gonna probably see this little old video, but man, listen, man. You said you want to fight the best, bro. Put him on your list. Let's see you test it finally against somebody that has pop, somebody that. Ain't, that's not going to fold And somebody that has a chin I want to see you Really push yourself to the limit man Enough of these fucking Lower tier level and These cab drivers man I want to see you push yourself You a dope fighter Canelo I give you that But now test your dopeness Let's get it I'm off this man I'll see y'all later on the next video Like subscribe support the channel I'll see y'all later Peace